Uh, hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today I'm at Redcroft Lake for the game against Ford, the final game, the game of the year, um, final game of the Atlas Cities in 2022. And we're already one along Craig Hutchinson, who joined us from Ford recently on his debut, scoring against his former club. He scored 20 goals last season, or something like that, I think. I've got told that I, uh, Ford fan, I can't remember how many it was, something like that last season, but he scored four goals for this season, I think it was. So you can't remember it's wild black and how um but I think it's like along those lines. But he's already put it's got put his, his one nil up. Let's see what happens now. Two nil now to Red Club Legs. Got Craig Hutchinson once again a great debut for him against his former club as um one v one with the keeper. Well actually you know he got past a few defenders, you'll see a forge actually, but brilliant goal. Uh, we were, in, we were in this position, we played these, well actually they were in this position, we played these last season at home and they won 3-2. We won 3-2, I mean. But it's like, that was all those goals happened in the second half, so... They even give them, let's see what happens now. Right guys, I'm joined here by the second hat-trick hero, Donny Holdsworth. Donny, how are you doing, mate? I'm good, mate. Good win. Uh, great performance from you. Obviously, brilliant hat-trick. What are your thoughts on the game? I thought we started well. Obviously, we went 2-0 up. It's far from there. We controlled it. Went, got a lucky third one, but came back into it and we just started dominating again. And just went from there. Yeah, obviously, been away from the game a few weeks because of the weather. How difficult has it been to come back into playing football? Uh, it's not been too bad. Every lad, we've been training a lot. Everyone's fit, so just right the goal, really. Yeah, and uh, obviously, I've lost a few key players recently. We're like Isaac Walker and George yeah. Rivis. How's that affected the team? Uh, it's tough to lose good lads like that, but the people that we brought in are uh, very good as well, so we can do, deal with anything, really. He's scored nine goals today, especially with how Isaac, much Isaac provided with goals. Yeah. How much does that help now knowing that we've got the goals still in us like that? Yeah, yeah, we've got loads of lads in the team now who can score goals, so that's always going to help us going forward. Yeah, and you've had an absolutely cracking season so far. How do you think it's gone? It's going well, yeah, we're doing well. Should start pushing on now, try and get higher up in the team. Thank you very much for that. No worries, mate. Alright guys, I'm joined here by the first hat trick hero, Craig Hutchinson. Craig, how are you doing, mate? Yeah, I'm good, mate. You? I'm very good. Great debut for you, obviously. Getting a hat trick against your former club, how does it feel? It doesn't get much better on Boxing Day as well. Yeah, it's like a like a late Christmas present, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, definitely. Probably the best one, to be fair. You haven't been here for too long. How have you settled in? Settled in straight away. The lads are all pretty much sound, yeah. They're all, they're all good. Yeah, and uh, it's a great win. Uh, what do you think went wrong for possibly your for, for your former club today? Uh, I think we were just too good to be honest. Yeah. I don't think they were below, uh, below average, but I just thought we were at it from the first whistle. So yeah. we just railroaded them kind of thing from the first whistle to the last. So you were at Farnaby last season as, as well. Uh, what, what do you think has gone wrong with it for them this season? I've been obviously finished third last season and now bottom of the league. What's... This could be a number of things, right, to be honest. I don't think the manager leaving didn't help the situation. Because mm. after that, people started moving on and moving on. Obviously, lads aren't enjoying it as much as they were. Well, I think the manager had a big part of playing when he left. Yeah. Well, uh, anyway... That was a great interview, thank you very much for that. Yeah, fine, thank you. Right guys, that is the end of the video. Thank you to both Craig and Doddy for the interviews. Um, you might see at the end of this a blooper. Um, it depends, because I've accidentally calling Craig Gary all day, and I have no idea why. And we recorded, that was the second time I recorded it, because I accidentally introduced him as Gary Hutch. Instant. Um, unfortunately, I've looked at him, and for some reason, when it's slow motion, uh, I might be able to get someone that, or find a way to try and speed up so it put like normal speed. So normal speed. So it does, I, I have been able to, you'll see at the end of this because it, it, it's hilarious. Honestly, we're, oh. I've literally called it, I've been calling, oh god, I really hope I haven't accidentally called him during this video. I have, you can all have a laugh now because that is so funny. We would, honestly, I couldn't be, it took us about another two minutes to get going again after that because we were laughing so much. 
Oh, what a crazy game, 9-2. Obviously, I did ask Craig a few questions about Thornaby. It's because he did just join us from Thornaby. Um, I think I was I had, was originally going to try and get Jamie Tunstall, the Thornaby manager. He'd agreed at half-time, saying that he would still do the interview. But after losing, obviously, 9-2, understandably. I've asked, I asked him and he said he um, doesn't want to do it now anymore. That's understandable. Completely understandable. Um... But yeah, I knew he wouldn't want to do it after the second half to be fair. I think he probably did what they do that after because um, they were in it and they were just unlucky to see two goals later in the second, first half. So I think that's probably why we still winning to up 5 2. But yeah, he's not winning to it now, it's, un it's understandable. But that is the final vlog of the year. Unfortunately, I was originally going to be going to Borough, but we're going to have to miss it. But my dad has had to go. He's got, he's been calling to work. I'm glad I didn't go because I would have got missed. But I'm um, sorry, I can't go to the game. Um, yeah. Anyway, yeah, that is the end of the video. Thank you all very much for watching. That is the final vlog of this year. I will have out soon my highlights of the year. The channel that will be. I went to start from there because a few people were coming past, were walking past me. That's why. Doing. Um, so, yeah, that's. So, thank you very much. I'll see you all in the next one. And happy. Also, I'll be involved Merry Christmas. Right, guys, I'm joined here by the first hat trick hero, Gary Hutchinson. Gary, thank you. Kyle Craig, all the